Hi everyone, Miss Megan from the CPL Teen Department here, and today we're going to explore the science part of STEM at home and a fun experiment using a classic springtime candy and liquids you have around the house. Let's get started. To perform this experiment, you will need peeps or plain marshmallows, containers to put them in, something to label those containers, and a few different liquids. I suggest at least one of them be water. Why water? It's because water is considered the universal solvent. According to the U.S. Geological Survey, water's chemical composition and properties allow it to easily attract other molecules. Heavy attraction can disrupt bonds or dissolve that molecule, so we can hypothesize that since water is the universal solvent, it should easily dissolve our sweet treats. Now, our marshmallows, whether in plain or peep form, are mostly sugar, which is highly acidic. So when selecting your other liquids, ask yourself how you think they would dissolve something acidic. I chose cola, white vinegar, and cranberry juice because they are all acidic to varying degrees. If the molecules in those liquids are more acidic or stronger than the sugar molecules in our treats, then they should dissolve. If they aren't, then our treat will probably remain relatively intact. I'm also using laundry detergent. I read a lot of very sciencey articles about how detergents work, and I'll say this. Laundry detergents contain lots of different things that help break down and clean off the variety of stuff that gets onto our fabrics and clothes, and at least one of them has to dissolve sugar, right? Before we move on, I need to tell you, do not eat or drink anything you've chosen at any point in this experiment. These aren't snacks. Setup for this experiment is really easy. Just label your containers with the liquids you plan to use, add your treats, and fill them about halfway with liquid. Your treats will float, and that's perfectly okay. For my experiment, I put one peep each in the first five cups and 20 mini marshmallows in the other five. Now place your containers somewhere they won't be disturbed and check back at least once a day for a few days. Which liquid do you think will dissolve these sweets faster? We'll find out in a few days with my own results. <music> Laundry detergent turned out to be the clear winner in this experiment. How did your experiment turn out? Let us know on our social media pages. Tag at chat libraries on Facebook and at CV libraries on Instagram. Use the hashtags at home with CVL and PeepSci. I'm Miss Megan from the Columbus Public Library Teen Department, and I hope you enjoyed today's STEM at Home Science Experiment. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. We are springing into summer learning at the Chattahoochee Valley Libraries, and the program you just attended is one of the ways you can earn completions. Just go to cvlga.org and look for Spring into Summer Learning. You can register yourself and your family online, and then start reading and attending our online events. That's all you have to do. We're giving away weekly gift certificates, and every completion you make enters you into a grand prize drawing for tablets, games, gifts, and more. Remember, you have to register to win, cvlga.org, and we'll see you online again real soon.